Yeah. I'm ready to party. <sighs> so, Indian said. Yeah, she's dead. And <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow. She is dead. Just like no sympathy. Now only Nurgle's echoing laughter remains. <laughs> <laughs> and also, uh, someone else's. What? <laughs> Tom's wife from another universe. <laughs> advice, the group heads towards Ostia. They are weary to the bone, and they need time to regroup. Ostia is the most heavily guarded fortress in the city of all Lycia. No enemy should have been able to breach its walls. Foreshadowing. Foreshadowing. <laughs> I remember hearing a similar thing about Zephyr's castle. Hmm. Sand I wonder. Time. Oh boy, who wants to voice act the boss of this chapter? It's amazing. Yeah, oh no. Heck that. Never. I appear to see that you are having a high road. Dude, stop talking to me like that. Where's my brother? <laughs> ah. He's a pirate yesterday for a country to Nigeria. He struggles for a third than half of my time. Did someone discharge this man? What? Well, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> that is a damn shame. Well, go prepare the room for my brothers and sisters. They need the rest, you know, we were partying and we went to a funeral. It was quite sad. I saw it with the brother that would have to discharge me. And he owes my mom money. Get out of my face. <laughs> Brother, he is away. Oswin, did you know about this? Why do you not tell me things? Uh, yes, I was aware of his trip. Again, you do not tell me things. Where did he go? Why is he there? Well, I don't get it. It's not like him. Uh. The secret that he's hiding. And then there's the tactician just, you know, fucking there, like, what is he doing? Greybeard, you know something. The what you see? <laughs> 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 oh god, I don't need to know that! <laughs> oh no! Oh god! Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Maybe I should that. What is wrong with you today? Hunter, <laughs> cut that out. <laughs> I'll censor it, um... Not appropriate for children on YouTube. <laughs> A lot of what Donnie said, like... That's fine, but... Friggin' Lucarius, chill a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> this episode's gotta put a rated R rating on it now. <laughs> <laughs> Not suitable uh, for advertisers. <laughs> the, uh, it implies the bad words. Um. Okay, Lucarius, <laughs> I'm fine either way. Like, if you want me to do it out, I'm fine doing that. But... I mean, it's probably better if you take it out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it probably is. <laughs> Tell me. What are we supposed to do now? Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> moment, lad. <laughs> yes, I suppose you've a right to know. Oh, I no. have no idea what I'm doing. I've known that all day. Our first met Nurgle some 500 years ago, wandering the Nevada wasteland. Like me, his only drive was a search for truth in this world. We were equals in power and knowledge, and we became fast friends. We believed we could solve the mysteries of the world. Like, why am I here? <laughs> we truly believed. So what happened? A disagreement made at the height of our quest. One day, I charted the, the mysteries of Nevada. I came across the most amazing village. It was unbelievable, but in that place, humans and dragons lived together in cooperation. Dragons and humans? Interesting. Are you telling me they could live together in peace? <laughs> they did a lot more than that. At oh, first okay, I well. doubted what my own eyes showed me. I didn't want to believe it. But yes, the village did exist. That's amazing. The dragons that I beheld there 
were both similar to and different from the dragons I had fought before hundreds of years ago. This is crazy. How I'm old is of this the man? Different sound effects I could use to censor out Lucarius's outburst. Use the use the critical sound from like Awakening or something. <laughs> yeah, just put my uh, Nurgle laugh or Nils or something. <laughs> screaming. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Hollywood, are are you gay? Hollywood. <laughs> Are you? you gotta tell me, man. You can't hide from the brothers. <laughs> As you wish. Bend over. Stop. Uh, okay, fine. I'll stop. Don't do this. To edit Ellie that out. Edit that out. They had refused to fight humans in the war. Instead, they retreated to this wasteland. They desired nothing but to remain hidden from the outside. Nurgle and I crafted a barrier and created an oasis for them. Upon their invitation, we lived there with them. Our life there it was calm and satisfying. At some point, the village became known as Arcadia. A place of perfect peace where travelers gone astray. Arcadia. The dragon's libraries were a dream come true to us. We studied their language and history with unbridled passion. A century, then two, time passed in an eye's blink, and yet slowly, our thoughts turned down different paths. In what way? I wanted to share the dragon's wisdom with others. My hope was for earthly paradise to spread outward. And Nurgle? Ah, oh, Nurgle. He took the dragon's knowledge. He learned the art of stealing the essence from living creatures and turning it into power. It was terrible. When we discovered what he was doing, the elders and I tried to persuade him to stop, but that power bewitched him, and he was deaf to our pleas. He started with small creatures and grew even more confident. Then he began draining the quintessence of humans. The villagers and I joined forces and defeated him, or so we thought, but... He had a horcrux here, <laughs> and then there's another one like... Over there, and then there's 20 over in burn. Oh, yeah, uh, <laughs> we're just gonna have to burn, burn to the ground. Hey! Anyways, we banished him to burn. Oh, yup, that was a mistake. He increases power slowly to avoid our eye. Using quintessence, he made his puppets the morphs. They were bewitching in form with intellects beyond humans. I'm sure you've laid eyes on them yourselves. Jet black hair, pale complexion, and blood red lips. Their most striking features are their glittering gold eyes. The heck? What? The heck, Jake? Is this guy again? I don't know who that creature Catherine was. I was staying guard. They passed me and I didn't do a dang thing about it. No, go to the basement and that's where you stay. Alright, cool. Anyway, how did they yeah, get in? Yeah, they're feared everywhere. Sure, right, right. Bye. The sack was so sudden, the cat who guards were annihilated. What? <laughs> that's so <Ostia. laughs> This is impenetrable. If it's been reached so easily, can we save it? Actually, don't say anything. I don't want to hear you speak. I think we're screwed. Magic Eden entrance for thugs within the castle. Blast! That's arrogance. No matter, no matter what, the throne must be protected. I'll, I'll not let this castle fall while my brother's away. Well, Tector, I'm going with you. Ow. Oh. I'm bummed. Bad <laughs> 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 Ellie would. <laughs> First it was, now it's, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> Hunter, we need to we need a plan. <laughs> we can hold them back for a while. We forces will come. Yeah, I know that much, dumbass. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this is something I'm gonna want to cut out. Uh, not for reasons. Dude, Bartray. <laughs> okay, is Dad not here anymore? Oh. Okay. Bring Vodya because she's best. Alright, this is the second to last, well, third to last chapter. I'm not I counting. I believe it! I'm not counting the other one because it's stupid. Uh, who wants to voice him? Uh, Fine. This is a <laughs> message from Lord Nurgle. I await you on the Dread Isle. This is a message from Lord Nurgle. I await you on the Dread Isle. This is a message. Is that the boss? Yes. Yep. So he's a fucking phone machine. <laughs> Tell all the soldiers. Take your posts and don't move. Hold your positions. All we can do is hold until... Hold on until our horses arrive. Hollywood. What? Don't overexert yourself. I'm fine. I'm not that weak. Oh, Elliewood. Ninian! You! You really really like your dress, don't you? Oh, you shouldn't God. be out here. It's so dangerous. Go around how you like room, do so you understand? Nas for Latu in silence. Science is the whole thing to worry about, um, but I'm fairly confident sending, like, Lucius because 19 resistance. The main thing I'd have to be careful about is, uh, the tome. Even then, I'm not bolting can't quite. I could snipe one of them out, but, uh, I don't think that's good use of it. What is Luis's resistance? 13. Uh, Pretty solid. Speed is 11, con 8, that's going to be minus 6, that's going to be 5 speed worth, so as long as I can get 9, so I can wield anything. Psh. Silver bow it is. In uh, Path of Radiance, there's no dark magic, so you have light mages with Nosferatu, and it's really bizarre. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like wind, um... Lightning and fire. Yeah. And then you just have light magic on the side. Have you guys seen the new Jumanji? I have not. What is Jumanji? It was this board game, I guess. And they, it was, there was a movie about, eh, there was a movie about it. And then now there is an even more recent movie about it, and it has Jack Black and Dwayne Johnson in it. I think uh, a friend of mine actually told me about it. It's really good. Becca's actually turning out really well. Like, originally her strength was really... I really got unlucky on, but it's turning up. Nice. So proud of her. So are you going to wait out the 11 turns, or gonna... Yeah, because if you actually kill him, um, reinforcements stop. I need all the XP I can get. So wait them out? Yeah, wait them out. Oh! <laughs> 
it was anyone other than Raven in there and Hawkeye, like if it had been a slightly different group, I might actually be a little worried, but because I have Raven to just hold that door, I'm not concerned. Because there's a lot coming his way. Oh. Rip. <laughs> I can take, pick off a couple of those snipers. Please and bow. Nice level ups. Eh, okay. Eh. <laughs> nah, I, I meant nice that she got two level ups. Not that the specific level ups were super good. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is sad. Oh my god, it doubles. <laughs> they Finally. did a thing. But did they? Yeah. Alright, here we go. I need Hector as strong as possible because our mods is... Probably gonna be my main way to kill the dragon. And if I yeah. can get him strong enough so that he can double, that is ideal. We are pretty darn close to the end of the. Yeah, I mean, this is a third to last real chapter. <laughs> he can double with bolting against these guys, I love it! <laughs> I really like how uh, the change of constitution and weapon weight works in uh, Path of Radiance. Yeah, that's my major critique for the Game Boy Advance games. Like, it's just stupid. Very frustrating, especially when you have, like, tomb weights that are 6 or 9 or something, and then your character's stuck at 3 for the whole game. I know, right? It's like, most mages can, like, never double unless you're, like, Nino. <laughs> I can you what up more. Yeah, they need to get a lot of the high speed growth, but it's just difficult sometimes. Shift speed pen that's going to be a four speed penalty. Your speed is sixteen. Yeah, no, I'm on the other hand his attack is only nineteen. Like even if he does crit, that's actually gonna be more than I'd like. Well, one weapon triangle advantage. <laughs> you use the chest keys, yeah. So, what are these chests again? Those are the gem and the Draco shield on top. Okay, got it. And there's a sniper somewhere holding a sword slayer. So is Young Ink this Saturday? Yeah. Or the qualifiers, anyway? Yeah, the qualifiers. Nice job. Alright, that's another one. Um, what do we do about down here? Fuck him up! <laughs> Square up, scrub. Do what Lacaria <laughs> says. Jeez, he doesn't have a A rank neither. Like, it's really gonna hold him back later in the game. Well, if I can't get it up in this chapter. It's already been established that you're gonna be wielding a heal blade if no one else. Hey, Luna! <laughs> yeah, and you can still barely do any damage with it. Yeah, because it's entirely based on your magic stat. Which is why Canis is stupid.
Your defense. Sixteen. Sixteen. Twenty-five. The hit weights are just not super good for um. A forty to thirty-two plus weapon triangle. How highly leveled some people are in Splatoon already. I know, right? <laughs> oh. Like I don't understand. Like it takes so long to level up. Like. How much time do you spend on Splatoon? Like, I can't even spend 40 minutes without getting annoyed at ranked, like, seriously. <laughs> what are they doing? Hey, Jeez. I have no idea. It's like, how do you spend all that time? You must have a lot of those EXP tickets, cause damn. <laughs> Goddamn. Yeah. Alright. Because I'm level 64 now, maybe? <laughs> and it takes a solid night of playing to level up once. Even I dude know, right? doesn't play that long and it's his freaking job. <laughs> yep. So obnoxious. <laughs> I kind of just like get annoyed whenever I see that he has a because it's just I don't want so to sit around for half an hour huh? see that he has a what? his tearing it up videos oh <laughs> because it's like I don't want to spend half an hour watching him shoot people it's not <laughs> entertaining <laughs> It's just the same thing. I only yeah. watch it when it's like weapons I think are cool. Like the 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 undercover bro one was interesting because it's it's, it's not like you know something something like fucking pro that's played like twenty four seven. So it was yeah, more interesting they, for me to watch. Why pro? Well, it's like just watch any tournament he's been in. He uploads those, you know. And those are more interesting because it's like, ah, this is, you know, how they coordinate instead of just dude killing people and occasionally saying something. Yeah, getting <laughs> like 50 kills on that scrub team. <laughs> <laughs> those poor, poor children. You, you crit him, boy. Yeah, you get him. Hawkeye only drinks the blood of his enemies. Wow, he's such a bro. soy sauce. Look at that sprite. Blah. Wow. <laughs> what? Hawkeye, you failed me. <laughs> wow, this guy does not give a fuck. <laughs> like... <laughs> There's a meme that I found years ago where it's just sitting on a throne defending and he's absolutely surrounded <laughs> by enemy <laughs> units and it just has the text like I give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> like I give a fuck. You can actually so do good. that with Hector! Yeah, you can. He's really good. So good. You go, Becca. You go, girl. Nothing's hitting her. Like, at least one should have at this point. Yeah, like that 44% right there. Yeah, which I think is actually more um, 35, but even so. There have been several like that. Oh, so friggin' Rolf, my sniper, has all. At 17. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, no. No, Raven. He's asleep. Don't worry, I, I'll just slap him and he'll wake up. Okay, how do I get... Uh... Hmm? I'm trying to think of how I can get the stave over there. <laughs> I might kill you with a longbow. No, crap, I only have one use left on it. Um... 
Hit him with the brave boy. No. That'd be a yeah, severe race. that brave boy. That sleep might actually be a problem. <laughs> Shoot! He can still dodge while asleep, I think. We're all gonna be coming <laughs> because that makes sense. Yeah, he can dodge while right? he's asleep, but <laughs> even so, I can spin out the herd while he's asleep. He needs to get for skill in there. In which case, Hector. Ooh, good bubble up. Yeah, I don't think Harkin's go traits are good. Like They're not quite that. as good as Raven, I think. Do we Does only have Bolting? Yeah, only stuff, I think. Oh, okay. I was like, Hunter, where's his other tomes? <laughs> <laughs> I was at work yesterday, and uh, one of my co workers is in like a cooking class. Like a high level sort of thing. And he told me that doing notes, he wrote down eggs as eggy boys. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh, because, it's spreading. Because of all the stupid things I say. Uh. <laughs> so grocery shopping, I got some eggy boys and yeah. some corn. Eggy boys, yeah. <laughs> hey, yo, you guys got any Eggy Boys? Oh yeah, we got those Eggy Boys right here. Yeah, I'm just gonna yeah, scramble up eggy. an Eggy Boy right now. Yeah, we got some Eggy Sandwiches. Eggy Boys. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want to replay Valencia, but I don't know if I, I do. should. I kind of do. I mean, I mean, I mean, for the story, I tried to sort of replay it, but, you know, it, it wasn't as much fun the second time, because, you know, you know all the plot twists. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The only different thing I would do is, like, change up the classes of the villagers, and that's pretty much it. I don't really feel like buying the DLC characters, even though I really like them. I don't really feel like buying them just so I can get a different feel. Who are the DLC characters? I know one's a Pegasus Knight. He's interesting. <laughs> The one with the Cavalier dude, he's like mad lazy or something. He's 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 a cool he's a cool dude. Then there's like this girl who's who like her cipher shit, she's a sword master. And since there's no like you know, female sword masters in this game, so she's like whatever a priestess, I think that's what the class is called, because they can use swords too. So I yeah, she's she's that and I don't really think she's that amazing. Then there's that like goth priestess chick that's basically like Probably the Look, best one out of them. Marlinus. Wow. Dude, what do you so small. Skill for. Yeah, we zero, <laughs> zero strength. <laughs> I need to oh, actually boy. like. Oh, sorry. No, you go. Uh, just I'm I'm saying I want to play it. But I also need to still finish Path of Radiance and then Radiant Dawn. So who knows how I'll feel after doing that. <laughs> Gotta do the Radiant Boys first. Yeah. Especially since I've only played those once. What were you saying, Taddy? I was gonna say, like, I had, like, this thing that I was doing in, um, um Echoes. I was, like going to grind out every unit and give them their super class. I already did like 10 of those guys and they're like all max and shit. Yo, this is, this is great. You should see my, what's, you should see my Celica. I was like, girl, she's so powerful, man. My fucking foresight is a, a god, dude. It's, a, it's amazing. I, I got rid of this stupid like, me off a bit. what are you talking about? He's great. No, the low goat traits. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they are. That's why you go and grind that DLC dungeon like I did for days to get two Star Spheres. God damn, that was so annoying. But it was worth it. It was absolutely you, worth it. You don't need to grind out max levels because the thing is, is that when you promote, your stats will always like go up to yeah. about the same amount. Yeah. So it makes the uniqueness of each unit less so. Yeah. But still... 
I like been maxing things, so I didn't really give a fuck. I was gonna grind out in later anyway. Like I learned that the range of like the healing magic, like goes up with like the, you know, the healer's like attack, and so like Tatiana has like fucking monstrous attack, and like her physics reaches the entire map. I was like, <laughs> dude. <laughs> I was like, oh, I'm gonna fizz this guy. I was like, oh, wait, he's too far. Click it anyway. I'm like, oh, never mind. She can just fucking throw her book at him and he's gonna heal. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Come on. You talk I to kill all of them so I can get Priscilla over there. Taking her sweet time. I'm using the silver sword so I can get uh, Hollywood to S+. Plus. Not sure if it's this game or B Binding Blade or both, but I know in Binding... Sorry, not Binding Blade, Sacred Stones, uh, that you do get a 5% crit rate boost if you... Gosh dang it. No, 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 no. no. 5% crit boost <laughs> if you... HA! Yes. Okay, he has one more use of the staff. Ha <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> Break bow that monster. Sorry, you're saying Hunter? Five percent uh, boost to crit rate if you level up your weapon rank to S with all weapons in that category. Oh, that's neat. He's nice. He's very nice. She's making her way. She's almost there. If I use a silver, I can one shot. Kill him. One shot one better. better way. <laughs> Are you within range of the boss now? I hope not. Especially after that good level up. Shoot. Oh no. Well then. Yeah. Denning. 18. He'll, he should be fine. Hopefully. Oh, crap baskets. Also, that thief appeared at the bottom, so he'll be body ring. Wait, hang on. Okay, so that would be 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yes, perfect. And I... Two, three, four, five, six. Make sure to double check. Actually, the strats. <laughs> I forgot I could do that. The rescue staff is certainly one of the greatest lifelines ever invented in Fire Emblem. I never used it. <laughs> Just don't think I, about it. I only used it in Echoes, <laughs> and it wasn't even the staff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I made uh, Faye Pegasus Knight on my run. I played uh, Fire Emblem freaking heroes, and I was like, gosh, she's an archer, but then I tried to come over and it's just like, why can't I make her an archer? Do I have to level her up more? I'll screw that. Nope. Turns out she can't become an archer, which confused me. Yeah. <laughs> it was weird. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure nobody would have want a healer fey anyway. <laughs> I know, just like, it's, it's a recommended class, but it's so boring. It's like, as long as there are seven healers in the game. <laughs> <laughs> Made, uh, awesome guy. They didn't want to make a Pegasus Snake because Claire was already there or whatever. Yeah. It doesn't, it doesn't matter, she would have been a shitty Pegasus Knight too. <laughs> she is. She's, she's, not even, she's not even that bad at when she's a Pegasus Knight in Echoes. It's just, I don't know why she's so bad in Heroes. <laughs> I'm gonna love having a thief again in Sacred Stones when we do that. <laughs> Cole and then Renek. 
I mean, that guy might end up missing because he's a bit of a pain. Oh, true. He is pretty hard to get. Especially Do you have multiple when... chances to get him, or...? No, I think you either get him in uh, Erica's or Ephraim's route. Hmm, maybe that's what I'm confusing. Maybe you're right, though. I know you get a couple chances... Sorry, you cut out. Uh, what were you saying? I know you get a couple chances to get Amelia, but I don't know really? about Renek. Yeah, because if you fail to get her the first time, then she shows up chapters later. Even if you kill her? No. There's a revival in goddamn bed. <laughs> Good, because I was planning on killing her. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I wasn't. Tati made me say that with her uh, witch powers. Yeah, uh huh. Yeah, my witch power that I totally have. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm, yes. <laughs> Hunter, do a spooky screen effect uh, to make that seem okay. Oh, shoot. This is a message oh, from uh, Lord Nurgle. I wait you on the Dread Isle. Oh, you're fine. Nice palette. Finally, something hit, but. She'll just be able to run from that. Break my right, but I might end up wanting to kill him. <laughs> Hit him with the brave boy. He still needs. She still needs to be healed. That's an unfortunate level. I have this running thing that I rename my weapons that I forge in face like ridiculous names. And now when I get the brave boy, I'm gonna name it Brave Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Towers boys wake up. Like, I would literally sit there for like, ever trying to figure out like, a really stupid name. I was like, what should I make Sizo Shuriken? And I just end up naming it Sizo Stick or some stupid <laughs> shit. Like, <laughs> uh. Sizo Stick. <laughs> Beta, go ahead and try and intercept. Uh, what's your defense? Oh yeah, you're good. I'm gonna try and have Beta intercept that guy. Does he drop it uh, once he gets it? I don't know. Thieves are kind of weird with that. But... Yeah, sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. No, break boy him. <laughs> no, I don't want to Can't die. Damn. And the weight might allow him him to double if he uses the uh, longbow. But what if she has a hundred percent chance to hit? Oh, you mean against this guy? Yeah. yeah. Um, I might have checked that, but I'd rather just heal her to be safe. Hang on. All right, so you'll be fine if I don't screw up. Huh. And she can take a hit. But she won't have to. I missed having the wolf bail. Well, actually, I never broke my original, but you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying. higher con. So, if I were to hypothetically do this, you'd be able to get some free damage off. You're not hitting... Oh wait, you might hit Raven. Hang on. Fixing... So, do you have any viewers of this? I think I have, like, one or two. Oh. Mainly, it's just one. Yeah. You know what, I'm not going to be able to get Ellie Wood over there in time, so I'm just going to open these chests. Having the extra money to spend at that place is going to be nice. Oops. I meant to take the chest key. Oh well. I feel like you don't super need the uh, 
extra money because three thirty thousand is quite a lot. It is, but you know, just in case. And because also... most of the stuff you'll buy is probably their killing. But even then, you don't need that much. Yeah, but I'd also like to buy some elixirs. Mm. And those actually are expensive in this game. Because unlike in Fates, they have three uses. Yeah, <laughs> the weapons in Fates were so weird. Like, each weapon had this weird bonus buff um, yeah. or nerf, or, and it was like, yeah, well, the well hang on, let me calculate. It's like, even steel weapons, effective speed, does that mean I'm three slower? What, what the heck? Yeah, it was something like that, and the civil weapons, like, they're super strong, but they debuff you at the end. It's like, it's like their own, like, weight, like, sort of. It's what they were trying to do with those debuffs and weapons and shit. They were, like, trying to apply weight again, but, like, in a different way. Yeah, and... It wasn't that bad, but it, it kind of, it was just weird. I'd it's much like, rather if they had implemented Khan again. Yeah, One, there's like no point rescues. of using like silver weapons where you can just grab an iron sword and enhance that to like plus like <laughs> five or something. And there you go, no penalty whatsoever, you're perfectly fine. That's literally all you have to do. And it's definitively better. I understand they were trying to make it so no weapon was definitively better, but... Uh-oh. Yeah, I don't think he'll drop that body ring. Dang it. But, may as well check. Kill him. I don't have anyone defending the spear to his head. I just realized that. You know, Hawkeye, you've done well. Now we need you to, uh... Well, actually, no. Let me send Pent back. This is just a uh, regular difficulty. Uh, yeah, this isn't Hector Hard. Good, because <laughs> the the next victory or death is such a painful chapter on Hard. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah, uh, victory or death, yikes. Especially if you want to move through all three directions. Ah. No, he's been sleeping for like 20 turns, like what the hell? <laughs> How much longer does he have? <laughs> this is his last turn. <laughs> brave boy! So, yeah, how's that brave boy? If I stand exactly here, I can physic you. Yeah, let me check what the brave bow does. Damn it. Oh. Uh, I told you so. Damn it. <laughs> My hopes and dreams. I can actually get a free shot with the longbow and literally no penalty as soon as I reorder my weapons properly. If then silver bow does silver bow confer any penalty. Perfect. And I attack with the longbow and I'll equip the silver bow right after and I'm good. Unless you miss, and it doesn't oh. break! It doesn't oh. break! Yeah. I hate this! <laughs> oh gosh. Well... <laughs> game Eight sucks, please Wait. switch. That, I'm minus four. Ha! You I still can't double. Oh my gosh. That gave me a heart attack. Oh, be Ra Raven just has to wake his dumb ass up and then he can kill him. Uh, Check that thief to see if he can drop. Right, right, right. Or not, but... oh. oh, he can! Be careful that archer right there, though. No, he has the Delphi good. shield. Uh -huh. So he can't take bonus damage.
Raven. No, he has pathetic attack, never mind. <sighs> Even you only take 9 damage from a single hit. And here we go. If I ever replay this game, I need to actually use Bar Bay. Try and get. <laughs> oh, Bang. that crit though! Now yes. you can break boy him. <laughs> I'm not sure I'll want to, just to be safe. Well, there's no other archers around. Oh, wait, no, she can miss, can't she? Yes! <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Told you guys so. Well, Raven's gonna wake up, so it'll be fine. Oh my god, we actually got poison, I can't believe it. <laughs> they didn't actually do any damage, but Hector might throw up in their faces now. They'll learn <laughs> to regret what they've done. Hector's not Negative gotten the one amount of defense I've wanted. It's like, 21 is still very good defense, but... He's gone up like, 8 levels and only gone 3 since his promotion. Well, actually, I think it's been more than that, but still. I am loving Rebecca as a sniper. She's super good. We're just torturing that poor, poor guard. Yeah, where are the arrows going? To his face. Because they aren't hitting through the rest of that plate. Uh oh. He's kind of like scratching his nose through his eye slit, getting poison on him. This is how you, uh... Shoot. Oh no. Hang on. Here he is. Ow! No! One space. Mm -hmm. He was one space off from being able to hit. If you hey, give us. Hector the, uh... The... what? If you, if you give him the, um, the body ring, then he'll only have one speed penalty while wielding armaments. No, I think it's only 17 speed panel speed 17, uh, weight. Uh... His constitution is 15, yeah? Yeah. I think? I'm pretty sure I just looked at it. Uh... What is, uh, Armod's, Armod's weight? is 18. Oh, okay. So it can hurt, although I don't know which the dragon I probably want to put it on uh, something else. Those vulnerabilities. Elixirs. Close enough. It has 15 speed. Let's go Silver Axe. Alright, so it would be only a speed penalty of one, but the question is, yeah. would he have enough speed to double the dragon anyways? Because if not, it might not be worth it. If you can get up to 21, and he has, like, potential of 11, he could double the dragon. 
Okay, so I would probably want to hold on to it um, and see mm, see what yeah. happens. That makes sense. If he can get those two speed growths, he could totally double. Here's Brave Boy. Wrong Brave Boy. Okay, do you want more deaths in this Let's Play? We've already gotten five. <laughs> Six if you're not careful with your words. Wow. I'm sorry. I could not be careful with my words. You feel me? Okay. Oh, I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean it like that. Calm down. Calm down! <laughs> What happened with that tournament last week? Uh, SCL. It did not go well. We were up against a team that won, I think a team that made second, and then the last, well, last team, Dece, couldn't make it. One of their members lost internet or something. Mm. So that we won by default, and that's just a crappy way to win. Yeah. So yeah, group stage, we were sweeped. I'm gonna hold on to the brave hacks. Um, if I could max out Oswin's defense, that would be fantastic. He's already at 29, I'm Almost not gonna wait to there. go shield. is Ellie Wood doesn't really excel in any areas, which is kind of how he's designed to be, but that's why he sucks. Do you know, um, what the dragon uses to attack with? Is it magic or uh, physical? Uh, there's no counter to it. Crap, crap, oh. crap, crap. Hang on. We're lighting his body block! <laughs> why? He can't walk through those units. Yeah, he can't, but I'm using Merlinus' body block to make him realize I almost killed Priscilla. Well, I can actually rescue with you. Oh. So it's fine anyways. If I ever do make ROM hacks, the first thing I'll do is give Merlinus an animation. <laughs> make him a legend. Did you gain a speed from that? I wasn't paying attention. Oh. But yeah, uh, the Dragon Tongue does 37 damage and he can't defend against it. Uh, so as long as he doesn't double you, you're gonna be fine. So if he does double you, I... You're usually gonna wanna let him initiate attacks. Unless you plan on physicking him or have a unit with like pens go up in his face. Yeah. Alright, chapter's almost over. For the next chapter, I'm really going to want to use Oswin, Hector, and Hawkeye. My bulk PR units just hold the lines because it's rough. Jeez! <laughs> <laughs> that poor thing! <laughs> well, that was a thing. <laughs> Eclipse is so useless. It is. They're it's as like useless the as these guards. It's the worst siege tomb. Yeah. Anyways, so we have these three guys to worry about, then that's the chapter. My dog is freaking out about something.
but uh, next chapter, I also want Lucius to be promoted. And I'm a little worried because, one, the frickin' low-as-heck defense. And two, because I want to also get her up to S+, which will be very difficult. Yep, that'd be a lot we'll of get her to S. No, not in staff. Uh. In light magic, so she can use Ariola. Do you mean Lucius? Lucius, sorry, yeah. Oh. I only get the Master Seal. Next chapter, oh sorry, Earth Seal. That'd be a lot of grinding. Jeez! <laughs> he hit with a clap. <laughs> that poor thing. I mean, he is done at that point. What a way Dude, to go. Like, that's kind of how Hector should have gone, except, you know, killing everything in his path. But eventually being whittled down. One damage eclipse. <laughs> I've routed the enemy. Rebecca is going to be able to wield the Super Brave Bow, what's it called in this game? It, it does hit four times, I did look it up. In the Ryan Flesh? Yeah, that. Flesh? So I'm gonna have... Super Brave Bow? Yeah, it can hit four times if you have the sufficient speed. What I'm planning on doing is having Oswin fight the people from that corridor, because they're all physical attackers. Um, and, you know... <laughs> so, yeah. What do I do now? There still needs a two-speed. Tati, have we killed you? <gasps> Lord Hector, have you read names? Protect Lord Nestor, Knights of Austria, attack! Um... We're the only ones here. <laughs> Considering... Ah! <laughs> Considering how they did earlier, I don't know. <laughs> hey, Gravy, I'm sorry, Tati? Tati? Did she leave? Uh, I don't know. Not muted, I don't think. Hey, great beard. Are these guys... Yes, I'm sure of it. They are his morphs. Hang on, let me quickly check Discord. Yep, nope, she's still here. She's been fairly silent, so... Anyways, yes, I'm sure of it. These are his morphs! It's true. They're all eerily similar. That reminds me. That man on Valor. FL. The Black Fangs. Sonya, too. Are you saying that he made all of them? It's an abomination. A crime against all that is natural. When Nurgle began using morphs to carry out his plans, his power had grown beyond our ability to contain him. He was having sex with whatever person would sleep with him was a real problem. After humans, his next target became the essence of dragons. And he also slept with one. His next target had to be Arcadia. They concealed our paradise behind a curtain of sandstorms. And I hid in the underground ruins and waited for him. I did not hope to defeat him, just to exchange blows and then draw him into the desert, which would be his end. But Nurgle never showed up, did he? Right, I have no idea how he managed it, but he called those siblings to the Dragon's Gate. I really wanted to blow him! <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh... Did I cut that out as well? No. Okay, yeah, we'll leave that one in. Um... <laughs> uh -oh. Oh, good. 
And now he wants to call a horde of dragons to this land. Oh, sorry, did I say horde? I meant whores. What do we have... Oh, sorry. What do we have to do to stop him? Our last hope is the power of the legendary items. It would take too long for us to gather all of them. I will go to the Shrine of Seals and tell Bramamond everything. We must have his power no matter the cost. Then we should go to the Dragon's Gate ahead of you. What? That's a good idea. Even though you cannot harm Nurgle himself, you can certainly do some damage to his troops. We don't answer Nurgle's invitation soon. He'll continue to send out send troops after us. If that's going to happen, we might as well take the fight to him. Don't have Lycia ravaged by any more of his acts. You you truly are Roland's children. You're assholes just like him. I'm old and not expect anything to surprise me again, and yet you assholes managed it. Orethos. It takes the strongest of bonds to alter the course of fate. Go, go, my youthful friends. Go to hell. Hollywood, Hector, where are the legendary items? They're right here. Mine too. I'm sorry. I simply couldn't bring myself to wield it. Neither. Oh, sorry. Neither could I. <laughs> Hollywood said it felt like Durandal moved by itself. A weapon with a will of its own? Can I really control a weapon like that? Frankly, I wasn't sure. Let me take them from you for a while. May I? Yes. It's fine, but... Hollywood, Hector, I understand how you both feel. But without these weapons, we won't be able to stop Nurgle. You know that, don't you? Yes. When next I wield it, I won't hesitate. Confidence is just a matter of time. I'll use it when I need to. You'll see, Greybeard. I know. Asshole. <laughs> Jeez. Oswin. I'm here, Lord Hector. We won't be able to contact Fargus about traveling to Valar till the day after tomorrow. The guards are rotating watches to protect the castle. Lord Hector, for this one night, please get some rest. Who needs rest? Do not talk to me for the rest. Do not talk to me of the rest when Ostia needs me. What the heck? There is something that you need to tell me, isn't there? I can think of nothing, my lord. Stop this foolishness. It's plain that everyone is avoiding me. What you're hiding, I know what it is. Lord Hector, you must calm yourself. Say it! I command you! Tell me what has happened. If you don't answer right here, right now, I will cut you down, Knave. Do as you must. <sighs> I see. My brother. He's gone, isn't he? Lord Hector! I was sure he was recuperating. He'd gone somewhere to recover his strength. I thought that was what you were hiding. But you won't even confess now. That means... Lord Hector! Wait! Please! Yeah, except that side quest. Whoa. All right, that's been a more full chapter. See you guys next time. Hopefully, we'll be able to finish the game in two more episodes. Yeah. Bye.